Hello my dear friends, I welcome you all to your very own channel that is Best Notes Tutorials and since last video we are working on improvement of our speaking skills okay and uh, this video the last one and today's video these two videos are for our beginners okay and uh, in my last video I have already told you all that what are the five basic tips which you have to follow in order to improve your speaking skills okay let me quickly revise those five the first one was what is the importance of English unless and unless you know that you won't be interested in learning any language forget about English okay number two be among the good speakers try to avoid those people who make grammatical mistakes okay and whose fluency is not good all right because whatever you listen in the same way you will speak out okay so in order to do that first thing you have to do is you have to remain among the people who speak good English you can refer YouTube videos news channels and some other means for that okay in your locality there might be people who are very good speakers you can copy them and learn and learn English speaking okay next point the third one was that learning two words every day okay this won't be burdensome for anyone because learning two word meaning is everybody's cup of tea okay you can learn it while traveling you can learn it while walking you can learn it while shopping as well okay so it's not a big deal therefore you can go for it all right next fourth point was that by learning banners posters hoardings in the uh, malls okay on the road the fifth one was that whatever you have learned you have to repeat unless and until you repeat it aloud remember i'm underlining the word aloud okay because unless and until you repeat it you won't be confident okay as i told you in my last video that only keeping in mind is not enough okay so these were the things which i had discussed in my last video i will move towards 6th 7th 8th and 9th and 10th points also so what is very important is point number 6 okay listen to it very carefully because point number 6 is going to be very important for you all all right and it is not only for hearing you all have to practically do it okay those who are genuinely interested you have to do it right now okay pause the video and then do it if you want to improve your english speaking all right so what you have to do in number 6 you all can see out here write your daily routine and repeat it aloud and in your mind as well okay so here what you have to do you have to write your daily routine all right where you have to write you have to write in small chits i can show you see in this video you have to make small chits like this okay and you have to write routine all the routines that you do right from the morning right from the dawn to dusk okay dawn d-a-w-n dawn to dusk d-u-s-k that means morning till night what do you do you have to write all the routines all right so let me give you example early in the morning what do you do you wake up from your bed right so at point number one you will write i wake up from the bed okay that will be line one next in next point you will write i woke up at 6 a.m next after waking up i folded my blanket okay folded my blanket next point will be i stacked them on my bed i folded the blanket i kept my blanket next to pillow okay this is your routine of early morning all right after that what do you do you step on the ground right so you have to write i kept my feet on the ground okay i kept my feet on the ground next line will be i walked towards the washroom okay i did not say walked okay i said walked 
Okay, in this way you have to pronounce the words. Alright, W A L K I N G. This will be pronounced as walking. Why few of the words are silent? I'll tell you in my next video. Gradually we have to improve. Okay, therefore we have to learn stepwise. Otherwise you will be confused and everything is going to be hodgepodge for you all. Alright, so right now what I am telling you all, write your routine. You all can see that these things you all can do. Write your daily routine on a piece of paper. Okay, paste it where it is visible. Okay, when you wake up from the bed, at that time you have to write all these lines on the wall which is against your head. Alright, where you can see when you wake up. Uh, because it will be at distance, okay. Therefore, you have to write in bold letters. Buy a chart paper, write points and then write your daily routine of your bed. Okay, and then in the washroom also you have to write the same. In the washroom, what do you do? Okay, and uh, here, what do you do? You go to the washroom and then you take a brush, you put paste on it. Okay, and then you brush your teeth thoroughly. So what you have to write? I brush my teeth every day with, I brush my, I brush my teeth with toothpaste. Okay, I brush my teeth with Toothpaste thoroughly. Okay. So in this way you have to write and you have to learn it. Okay. Those small structures you have to learn it. Alright. And then after learning it you have to keep repeating in your mind. Remember it. Keep repeating in your mind. You must have seen in maximum videos of English speaking. They ask you all to think in English. Okay. Think in English. Now how to you know, make uh, your mind work automatically, okay, so that it will think in English. So, this is the first step, okay. Once you write all these, you know, steps in the wall, in the door, in the mirror, etc., okay, you will learn it, you will repeat it and automatically in your mind, you are going to learn the same thing and you are going to think in English, okay. So, when you look at these points every day you will repeat it and then you are going to learn it automatically okay at least you will be ready with these structures and once your structure is good you can replace these words with something else okay something else and then you will be ready with your basic lines of English all right and for doing this let me tell you that you have to be like Arjun okay you must have uh, heard from your elders, from your teachers about the competition that he had with his uh, brothers, okay, where he had to hit the eye of a bird, okay, and then he was not able to see anything else, but he could see only the eye of the bird, all right, so your focus should be like that, you have to be like Arjun in order to learn English, what I want to tell you is that focus on learning, okay, once you write this you know, lines on the wall, on the mirror, uh, in the washroom, you will not be able to see anything else. You have to focus on these lines. I know these lines are very simple for some, but if you ignore it, you will never learn it at all. Because right from the basic, you know, right from the simple things, we have to move to the complex. That is the theory of education. We cannot move to complex things at one go. Okay, we have to start from simple things. Gradually, we have to make it complicated and then we will, you know, make it uh, complex and make it easy as well. And this is going to be through practice. Okay. So, these are the things that you need to keep in mind if you are genuinely uh, wishing to learn English. Okay. Number one is clear, I guess. Okay. Let's move to next point. Next point is diary writing. Now, diary writing does not mean that you have to write in diary only okay right now because of the advancement of technology you can type it in the computer okay and then you can edit it what why i am encouraging you all to type it in the computer uh, is that in the computer you can ch make changes on everyday basis you type something okay if you make error you can edit it later on as well 
by this you will understand that you know how was your english how was your english couple of days ago and how is it now uh, have you learned few you know more advanced words to replace the words which you, which you have already written in your diary okay diary here means computer right or your status is similar to the earlier one if it is yes you have to improve okay so on a daily basis if you write your experience what has happened apart from the routine that you did okay because the routine that you have done i have already asked you all to write to repeat it on everyday basis okay what i want you to do is that make a folder in your computer write my experiences okay my experiences on everyday basis you type something and what is what is that something your experience of entire day okay don't make it too lengthy all right whatever important things has happened in your life you just type it out all right if you don't know particular word okay which has happened in your life then write it in hindi also okay but underline it so that you can replace it later on okay and that will show that you know how much improvement you have done till now understood okay now you know uh, if you do it every day basis what will happen your memory power will be sharper you will hone your grabbing skills and that is another important thing while we learn english all right we have to listen for that you your mind should be very sharp all right and this is how we are going to and sharpen our mind okay we have to be focused we have to meditate and meditation is going to be done when you type something which has happened throughout your day uh, number 8 says that you have to copy somebody okay you have to copy somebody who is a very good speaker and remember it is not only about speaking good english your pronunciation comes in it your personality will be revealed you know the way you speak english okay and automatically uh, your status will also be understood status i don't i'm not talking about uh, monetary status i'm talking about how cultured you are okay how cultured you are how much hard work you are doing in order to improve okay your hard work will be visible from the pronunciation that you do the words that you use okay your is your locality people might be knowing that you are from government uh, schools okay you are from the school where uh, english is not prevalent all right so you have to prove them that school comes at secondary level okay at first you have to try from your end all right abdul kalam who used to sell newspaper we cannot imagine that he go he went to some english school but when you uh, see his speeches you will you will be amazed to see the words that he uses okay you can follow king martin luther as well all right the words that he used you know the way the confidence that he shows that is worth copying okay so what i want to tell you is that the person who is there in your locality who speaks well you have to copy them all right copying is imitating is not bad always okay if you are imitating for some good cause then this is not going to be unethical anyway all right so here what i want to do you all is that find out that particular person who is very fluent speaker he speaks good english with correct pronunciation and then without any grammatical error okay if you do that then automatically your uh english will improve in no time you know the routine that you have made apart from that you tell your family members to ask okay that what uh, do they want what do they want you to answer okay right they they might not ask you in hindi uh, they might ask you in hindi or their mother tongue but you translate and prepare answers for the same okay you have already prepared your daily routines list you have already maintained your maintained your uh, diary okay you have already written the routine on the wall 
okay on the mirror on the washroom etc you are already maintaining a diary also okay where you will write entire day's experience okay the words that uh, does not come in your mind at that time you can replace it later on as well after writing your diary completely okay so these are the things that you are, that you have to do okay next make an audio okay this is extremely important however hard work you do this is the thing if you skip this then you are not going to learn anyway first of all what you have to do the routine that you have written on the chit you have to utter it okay you have to pronounce it and pronounce it right uh, you know record it in your device okay record it in your mobile phone and then listen to it if it is not perfect delete it and then uh, make it again all right so in that perfect manner okay every day you have to revise the thing okay don't repeat wrong sentence don't repeat wrong pronunciation this is going to waste your time i'm repeating this point since last video it is because i have done the same mistake okay i had learned from wrong uh, group of friends okay who used to speak wrong english i copied that and you know rectifying took a lot of time sometimes i you know i used to lose my confidence as well but right now fortunately i got good teachers okay from my end also i took uh, whole hearted attention to this and not only that um let me tell you one very important thing there is there are two kinds of people one is competent one is committed okay the competent one if they don't exercise their caliber their skills then they are not going to learn okay they are not going to they are not going to remember what they what they are not going to remember what caliber they have okay and there is another person who is committed committed means every day they are doing the practice okay every day they are practicing every day they are repeating the words every day they are repeating the sentence so their mind is tuned into the structure now okay now there won't be any mistake from them all right so so repetition is very important okay you have to repeat even if you learn simple spelling you have to repeat it every day okay every day you have to repeat it that is the key to uh be a good orator okay good speaker orator means a speaker okay so these are the points which are extremely crucial so i hope uh, this is going to be you all are going to practice the same okay the diary entry which i mentioned in uh, to do in computer some of the candidates might not be having computer at home so how they can rectify their mistakes if they make it because if you write with pen in your diary and you are not able to do the editing work it will be very burdensome for you okay there might be candidates who don't have computer at home or mobile phone as well okay of that quality where they can write on their um, experience okay so what should they do they can type it in the whatsapp okay and then they can send it to themselves okay to keep a record or you can make uh, you can save somebody's number okay and then keep sending tell them that you are going to send your experience whatever has happened in your entire day you will share it with them okay so what you are going to do you are you are going to type it okay you can do it through typing method also keypad also or you can do it from voice as well okay in this way what will happen you will at least utter english words okay utter english words if not you can type it and send it and after 2 3 days when you have a stock of words okay then you can replace those simple words simple structures with different words in this way you can learn english very easily and uh, friends these two videos are for the beginners i'm going to start with advanced level as well okay for that you have to keep in mind that repetition is the key to success practice is key to success and remember 
hit once hit hard okay ek learn once learn perfectly i keep on repeating it i am repeating the same again so please do this every day okay and apart from these things if you require any help from us do let us know and uh, we are going to start a group in our whatsapp for english speaking if you wish to join do message us okay and the, in this video in this uh, whatsapp group what we are going to do let me give you just for that see unless and until you have somebody to speak with you will not learn okay you have to have a partner at home they might say that what is the use of english in our home okay we are okay with our mother tongue so in that case your progress might get hindered okay stopped so here what you will do you will do message us you will interact with us because we are not going to laugh at your mistake okay rather we are going to uh, uh, poke you right wherever mistake you will do we are going to poke you and we are going to rectify as well all right so uh, we need critics as well in life okay so if you are friends your relatives are criticizing you no problem you just repeat okay keep repeating the things that you have learned and then do interact with us as well every day we will be after you whether you have done the assignment that we have uh, given or not if you are going to follow our instructions then certainly within one week of time you will see improvement in your english you will be confident as well okay and finally you can see the result okay you can take example of me also i'm not proud you know i'm not boasting myself but the uh, you know hard work that i did is paying now all right for that i am very happy so i wish even you all be confident you all be ready for the interviews and then you will some day thank our channel for improving your english speaking skills that is our motive so friends i hope this video was helpful for you all do let me know and then tell me what do you want apart from and tell me what do you want apart from this and uh, one of the messages i have seen recently that grammar lessons uh, to be taught so let me tell you that right now i am focusing on english speaking certainly grammar we have to do uh, in a bit later level okay that we will do certainly because without grammar english is incomplete right now i am not asking you all to focus on grammar because that is going to be hot pot for you all okay so gradually let's learn the topics that i have told you all the things that i had told you all to do please do that and then tell me whether you have practiced whether it was helpful to you all or not okay we will meet in our next video till then take care bye bye